I really do believe in angels, and I really do believe that I have a guardian angel. It does feel external to me. It does feel like there's somebody or something out there that is using me as a channel to deliver this, this product, which I never did before. I didn't do this before. <laughs> was a disaster. I mean, no one knew what to do with me. I had gone to a rehab facility. It was terrible. But while I was home with nothing to do and being miserable and in so much physical pain, a good friend of mine came over and said, look, if you're going to be like this for the rest of your life, you're gonna to have to figure out something to do with yourself. She said, well, I brought you some paper and some paint, and I just thought maybe you might be able to paint or something. You've always been creative. And I was so upset. I've never been able to paint in my life, so why would I be able to paint now? But when you are stuck with hundreds of hours by yourself in a room, you know, I started to look at the supplies and I went, eh, you know, I'll just try and doodle. And what I found was that while I was still very cognitively confused and uncomfortable, the doodling made the time go faster. I mean, just think about the way you would doodle on the phone or something, you know, just make, I just started to doodle making shapes and suddenly an hour went by and when you are faced with a full day, not being able to really go outside, do anything fun, see people, making an hour go faster it was a miracle. I just started making these paintings of little, actually they started as little hearts with a lot of texture on them. At that point, Facebook was just a lifeline for me. So I would do one and I would just like put it up there and say, you know, this is what I did today. And people really responded to it and then they would share their personal stories with me. And as they shared their personal stories with me, I asked if they would send me photographs of themselves so that I could paint their likenesses and that's how the portrait started. Things have changed in the last year with my relationship to my art. Up until last year, I really didn't understand what it was that people saw in it. Now when I look at it, I do see the specialness of it and I do see the miracle behind it that I was so sick and to be able to find something that has brought me back to life but also has become my business and my livelihood is incredible. When I make it, it's something that I can do almost effortlessly. It's a joy for me to do it. I feel so fortunate that people from all over the world have found me and that my art is hanging in almost every major city in this country. And that is nothing short of magic to me.